So Samuel's helping me today. We've got a roast and gravy almost ready. We're making some rice to go with that. We're doing some black eyed peas, which I like to also put black eyed peas on my rice. I don't know why. Um, we're also making Mexican cornbread, Granny Ronnie's recipe. We have corn that is baking. Actually, I cooked it yesterday because after the freezer went out, we had to cook a lot of corn and peas and all that. So I'm going to heat all that back up and have that. I'm going to wear my new apron my sister got me. I never take time to make one or buy one. And also, check out my shirt that Faith bought me. It says, it's all a mess. Hair, my hair, my car, my kids, the house. That is so me. So I thought Faith thought I needed that. It's getting hot in here. So this is my apron that my sister got me. So I guess I'll get that off. Anyway, she got me an apron. I guess she knows how I am about not taking the time for myself to do anything. So she got me one. And I don't want to mess up my new shirt that Faith got me. So, it's got an adjustable thing here. So you just loop it in and back out. Kind of doing a slide side. I'll leave it where I can take it on and off. I won't have to do that. But this is the first time I've actually worn it. But I really like it. Um, it reminds me of our summers with all the vegetables and stuff coming in. And I love my carrots and potatoes and English peas and stuff, so I really like it. Thank you, Maggie. And then we had a baby egg like that. Look how little. Compared to, well, can't get it out. There's a regular egg and there's a baby egg. Our chicken flayed that one, son? Yes, ma'am. It did? That is so tinky, tiny. Anyway, we need four eggs to go in our cornmeal. So we need to crack four of these, Samuel, and put them in there. And let me get over here and dump our rice. So you ready? Okay. We're doing Granny Ronnie's cornmeal. I'll tell you as I go along what the ingredients is, so if you want to bake it some yourself. What I do is for a nine by 13, because we're a big family, and it takes a nine by 13. And you can do it in a glass dish or a regular baking pan, it doesn't matter. But you bake it for about close to an hour if you do a nine by 13. If you do the nine by nine, or the little square, it takes about 30 minutes. Um, sometimes you have to adjust it, make sure it's brown on top. But we're doing it nine by 13. Samuel and I have already put three cups of cornmeal, four eggs, and then he's gonna put two cups of milk. And then we need one and a third cup of oil. Just a second, go ahead and start mixing that, Samuel. Swish it out now. These boys are gonna know how to cook for a girl. Keep that now, keep mixing. Okay, here's one and a third cup of oil. You got to mix really, really, really well. You want me to show you how to do it? Let me show you. You just keep doing it like this. I use a whisk because it does say it mix very well and the whisk just works so much better trying to get all the eggs and everything blended. Okay. Now, he's going to still continue this. While he's doing this, it says like eight to 10 jalapenos. Well, I don't have those whole right now. I usually put them in a little mini chopper from Pembroke Shelf and chop them up real fine. And since I don't have those, I already have some diced ones. I just won't put as many. I'll probably put just um, a couple of little spoons. But I do like them finer than this, but we improvise. And I'm gonna add a little bit of juice. And that don't make it hot, hot, but it gives it a good flavor. And then we put a whole can of cream style corn. Mix it from the bottom, baby. Touch it. And that's all there is to it. It's simple, quick, everybody loves it. It's very, very moist. It's not one of these, you get cornbread and you gotta choke it down. No, I don't like that. None of my family does. So I like really moist cornbread. So that's what this is. So I don't know if you can see it. 
And since a lot of my pans are messed up with all the other meat and stuff that we've been trying to cook, I'm using a glass dish today. And it cooks pretty much the same. Um, you might have to leave it a couple minutes longer. I just wait until it's brown, golden brown on top, and you're good to go. But normally, like I said, a nine by 13, in about an hour, it should be done. I just check it on and off. Can you open the My corn's in there already. I got the corn going. Delicious. Hey, so you're making some tea. Hello, babe. Happy 2022. You looking forward to it? You graduate this year. That's the only thing really I'm looking forward to. I'm not even looking forward to that. I don't know. It's just weird. You don't want to grow up? I don't know. I don't really want to, but I kind of have to. <laughs> it's kind of a requirement. We love you. I love you too.